Got a new uh, AquaSmart control. Okay, uh, a lot of people like it. Every day I see more, 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 more. And uh, I don't know how the company gonna like this. The company who make that, those, those AquaSmart. Uh, they don't buy. They, uh, guys, guys say, well, 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 so what's the problem with those things? Said, well, it's a sensor. It's, it's not a low water cut off. So I, I stand in the corner, right, and say, well, you know, what's wrong with this guy, you know? What's wrong with this specter, you know? And he say, the AquaSmart is a sensor control. Okay, guys, it's, it's a sensor. But, dude, the old sensor, no matter what kind of water cut off you, you put in yeah, there, well, they have, I've seen it, there's one or two, they have a, like a little ampelle. I think goes, is all the way moving, keep the contact open. Uh, but, most common low water cut off, it's, 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 a, it's a sensor. So this guy, he's making a big deal about that. It's a sensor, it's not a low water cut off. Uh, why he say that? I don't know where he get information, where he's st staying behind that. Maybe that low, maybe that sensor got something else going on too inside there. Because it's a lot of, that Aqua Smart. It says, uh, I guess it's, it's a heat manager too. I haven't looked into it. In fact, I got one in my truck, but I haven't really, really looked into it. It's a heat manager. It's a freezing protection, something like that. And a low water cut off, and I got a high limit, low limit. I mean, this this control does it all. I mean, you don't need nothing else. You put a, you put a system on, you put a boiler, you hook up this control, it do everything for you. But, expect to say, they're going to start failing. So you guys up there who's putting this Aqua Smart, starting next year, they're going to go around. And they're going to fail with those, uh, they don't have low water cut off. They want to see physical, the physical want to see a low water cut off. So, okay. Believe it or not, I already, you know what? I, I should bring that up. I already have problem with those, those Aqua Smart control. I had a call. One o'clock in the morning, guys. One o'clock in the morning. Uh, I go to uh, I had a dryer two hours driving. Two hours driving. I went to this call, and uh, guess what? It was a new installation, and uh, it was a new installation, and uh, uh, the unit was off. Okay, the unit was off. So, uh, again, it say, uh, the unit says, well, the reading, because now they got the little screen where you can read what was the problem. So it says, sensor problem. Well, it give you a code, and then you look at the back of the code, and it give you, it tell you what's that code mean, uh, F2 or 3 or whatever they call it, or L, U, 2, you gotta go back in the cover, you read it, and then tell you the problem. So the problem with this was with the sensor. Now, this guy, uh, hmm, you know what, now that I'm thinking, now that I'm thinking, if you look at regular low water cut off, it's like a pro, it got like a pro on it, okay? Maybe sensor because it's flex. It's like if basically you when you're looking at it, it's like a, it was kind of flex type of thing. And a regular low water cut off, you really have you really got there's no well. You know what? That guy, it makes sense now. It really makes sense. This guy makes sense now. Now I, now I know what he was talking about. 
guy, this is what it 